Hi, Grant Lawrence in Desolation Sound, British Columbia. And as you can see behind me, that water is usually a, a crystal clear blue. Up and down the Strait of Georgia, it's impossible to ignore. In some areas, bright green, others a tropical turquoise. At the top of the mountain overlooking Howe Sound, tourists and locals alike are puzzled but pleased. Down in Vancouver, it's really green compared to usual. I don't know what to expect up here because I think there's there's some mountain runoff too, so not sure. But it is, it's pretty spectacular. Glacial runoff normally creates a spectacular color here in Squamish, but right now these vibrant hues are up and down the south coast. It's really common in Norway, for example. Yeah. Scientists point to a type of algae that isn't normally found here. I think what's really unusual about this is, is the particular alga, the little microscopic plant that's causing this. It actually lives in a, a little house made of carbonate, like cement, but it's highly reflective and so it shines. So from space, quite often you can see those blooms. And that's exactly what you see in these images, captured by a NASA satellite taken over the past week as the bloom spreads. I've never seen anything like this in 30 years of living here right on the shores of Howe Sound. From his patio, this conservationist worries about what it all means for the environment. The color, the potential melting of the glaciers and the algae are all giving us a big wake-up call that if we don't do something about this quickly, we are really going to be having some serious, serious problems. The algae is not harmful to marine life or people. The mystery is why now and why here? Scientists say they don't know if this is a climate change story or if it's just a once in 20 year type event. If they occur too frequently and are too dense, they can have negative effects as well. But I wouldn't be worried about this one, at least not at this point. So for now, take out the camera and enjoy the tropical view no further than right here on the BC coast. Renee Filipponi, CBC News, Squamish, BC.